All right, guys, welcome back to some more MLB 9 Innings 21 content. We got another good one for you today. We're going to be training the new team Vintage Sig we pulled in the last pack opening. And then also we're going to be getting Pedro Guerrero finally to Black Diamond and using premium skill change tickets to try and get him a legend skill. Also, AK's Gaming and I are going to be doing another collab live stream pack opening this Saturday, January 1st, 2022, New Year's Day at 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, opening up a team select signature pack that should come in the New Year's special package sometime this week. And we will have a special guest that will be opening packs with us as well. We will announce that during the stream. And on top of that, I'll be doing a New Year's special package giveaway to one lucky winner, and they'll be chosen during this Saturday's live stream. Essentially, I'll be giving away $200 in cash that you can spend on whatever you would like, but it's to promote that package that has the team select signature pack, GI, all that good stuff, about $200 in value. I want to give back to my community because you guys are seriously so awesome and I can't express in words how appreciative I am of all the support you guys have given me over the past year. And I figured let's start off the New Year's right with a cool giveaway for you guys. So there's a Gleam.io link in the description of this video. Click on it, it'll take you there. There'll be seven different entry options. You can get up to seven entries into the giveaway. I'll be choosing the winner during that live stream, like I said, at the end of it. And this has been open from New Year's Eve at 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time to 724th. And it'll end on January 1st, New Year's Day at 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time during the stream so that if some of you guys missed it, you guys can still be reminded during the stream to go do that. And then, like I said, we'll pick it at the end. So hope you guys are looking forward to that. And let's go ahead and get straight into the video. So we don't have any cards to upgrade today, but we do have the Vintage Dodgers starting pitcher Jerry to train in this one. So we will get him to level 20 eventually. We have 10 upgrade tickets. We can get them there and we will be using them on them. But I want to wait until after next week when we open up the team select signature pack to see what we get before we do that. So we're going to get him to 10 today. Try and get a good train to, through 10 if we have to use a reset ticket or two because of too much stamina, we will. Let's go ahead and get him trained up and see how long this takes. Obviously, we're going to go for a finesse train on him. He's already towards finesse. I would like to see getting a lot of velocity as well because that's the one weak point of this card. But the way this is looking, if we don't get some more velocity here soon, we're going to have to reset. I, I might be able to have velocity actually go number one with how much that difference is between location and velocity, but we'll see. I, I'll talk to some of my club mates and stuff as well, get your guys' opinions, um, and also use some of the um, thing, resources out there that we can use to calculate what we can do to still have finesse pitcher, but also have the best possible stat with it as well. So we're through almost 10 right here, and I don't even know where we're at. This is the last one. Let's see, that one works. So we are, at five stamina through level eight. So that's an automatic reset. So I'll reset this card and then I'll show you what I stick with through 10. Okay, so we are at level 10. We used a few level reset tickets, but this is what we got. We got plus five to location, plus seven to velocity, zero to stamina, plus nine to fastball, and plus six to break through 10. So this is not ideal in terms of finesse pitcher train right now, but we can finish this off and see how it goes through 17. Then we finish it off with amp tickets after that. We can still make this a great train and I don't I want to keep this right now because we're only through 10. You never know what we're going to get to location and break in the back half of this. So this is actually a pretty darn good to train to sit with right now. And we can always, like I said, adjust it with uh, amp tickets. So that's what we're going to stick with. I'm actually very happy to see zero to stamina through 10. I don't know if I've ever had it before. So Jerry, I, I'm, I'm, I'm actually really excited about this card right now. So now that we got Jerry to level 10, it is finally time to get Pedro Guerrero to Black Diamond. This is what he's looking like through special training level seven, obviously trained up to level 20. Looking really good right here and I'm so excited to get him to Black Diamond. I think the Black Diamond vintage cards, especially the signature ones, look so sweet. So I'm finally excited to get the first vintage card to Black Diamond. Let's go ahead and do this thing. All right, so here we go. I'm super excited for this. I don't think there's anything more exciting to me than this Black Diamond animation, besides the Sig Change Ticket one, especially when we did that on Grinky, that was so cool looking. But here we go. We got like 200 something pieces right now. It took, requires 160 total. So let's go ahead and start doing this thing. Here he is. I've been wanting to get this card to Black Diamond for a while. His hitting stats are so, so good. It's just, I'm, I'm really excited to have him and then Bellinger right after in the lineup. It's gonna be really cool to see. And then if we get a good uh, legend skill on him, that'll be awesome as well. One more after this, and then he will be a Black Diamond card. Like I said, that card art, the vintage Black Diamond signature card arts are so sweet. Here we go. Three, two, one. All right, we did it. We did it. Oh, man, here it goes. Good. I love this animation so much. It's so sweet. There he is. Oh, man, that card art is just so sick. Man, finally, Black Diamond right there. So now, now that he's Black Diamond, 
Let's go use these premium skill change tickets to try and get a legend skill on them. So before we use the premium skill change tickets, I wanted to show you guys the skills. We are working with them right now. We have prediction level 7, charisma level 7, and training junkie level 5. Not terrible, but I would like to get something else that besides prediction. And we do have a second skill sword slot. That's what it is. And that's what we're going to be changing. We're going to be trying to get a legend skill right here. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay, so we have six premium skill change tickets. I'm really hoping we can roll a legend skill between these six, as they don't come by that easy. I know you can craft them, but please, please give me at least one legend skill on them. That would be awesome. Let's go ahead and find Guerrero, that new card. Oh, that, that, that card art, it just, I love it. Here we go, here we go. First one, let's see. Let's see what we roll on the first one. All right, so no, no. Well, I would rather have actually the one on the left right now, not gonna lie. All right, next one. Here goes another one. Here goes nothing. Come on, Pedro. I know you want a legend skill. Okay, maybe he doesn't. Five tool player. I've seen you way too many times. Please go away. All right, two down. Here's the third. Come on, please. <sighs> okay, we're halfway there and still nothing yet. Please. Please, I would love to see a legend skill on this card. Come on, Pedro. Here we go, Pioneer, and I believe is that. Pioneer is a usable legend skill, so we'll keep that for now. We do have a blue skill change ticket as well. So obviously we don't have any skills with it, but Pioneer, I love seeing that. We will take that. I will take that for sure right now. Yes, yes, yes. So this is pretty much like training junkie, but as a legend skill. So I'm I'm actually gonna, I'm excited about that. We'll keep that for now, and I, I have two Two premium skill change tickets left for another card. So, there we go, baby. All right, so now that Pedro Guerrero is now Black Diamond and we got a legend skill on him, we're gonna go ahead and do some arcade mode gameplay for you. So let's go ahead and get straight into it. So we're gonna be doing this the same way we have the past few videos. We're gonna be using these four buffs on the first one, then we'll do another game with all the buffs and we're just gonna do two of them because then it makes the video too long and I just wanna get some gameplay for you guys. So let's go ahead and start this one off. So our higher score this week is 2.3 million. Hopefully we can break that. We will see um, his change up in curveball pretty nasty. So you guys know how that works. I don't need to complain about that today. You guys know the change up, uh, the change up curse, I guess. Um, obviously when there's no change up, take advantage of that and try and set your high score then. All right, okay. Not off to a bad start right now. And, and then I say that and I immediately miss the change up. So I just need to stop jinxing myself. <laughs> okay. I have to say, I love doing this, doing arcade mode with uh, with Belly. His power is absolutely insane. This card is just a beauty of a card. I'll never forget the day I pulled this card as a diamond. Oh, that was a great day. My first ever team select signature card was a diamond. What are the chances of that? All right, and uh, another miss change up. So I honestly, I honestly want to throw something right now, but I'm just, I'm going to control myself. I can't say I haven't thrown my phone before due to a change up. So. But we can't throw my computer that I'm playing on right now. It's a little bit too big for that. It might actually go outside and break the window. So but if we were to do that. All right. So we are not going to get anywhere near our high score on this one. But with all the buffs, we'll see if we can. Honestly, though, some of you guys were commenting. All the buffs sometimes make it harder to get a higher score because the longer you keep going and stuff and everything, they like they throw multiple change ups or curveballs in a row and it just really throws you off. Like I've seen three or four changes in a row and I've hit two or three in a row, but that last one just always get me. So we're gonna see if we can get this with all the buffs right here. Come on, come on, can we break this? Can we get like 2.5? We're in like gold one or two right now, but I would like to try and get solidified in gold one. This is the last day to do it too, so. All right, all right. Not off to a bad start. All right, we held back on that one. There we go, there we go. All right. Dang it, dang it, don't throw it again. Okay, I thought it was for sure gonna be another change. Dang it! Goodness, that's the thing, I'm just saying, they're just, oh, why do you have to throw so many change ups? Like, can, there's normally one of these, one of these rounds where they'll throw like one change up a curveball and then the rest are fastball. I have not had that this week. It's just really aggravating because that's normally when I set my high score and I have not had that this week yet. It's just so aggravating. I don't think we'll be able to break it. We're not even close and there's another change up. Just at this point, at this point, uh, it's goodness gracious. All right, so we won't be able to break it, but we'll probably get close to two mil. Just depending on how far these balls go for the bonus balls. We have four of them. We had the extra one from the buff. 
Um, yeah, we'll get close to 2 mil. I don't think we will. We'll probably be at like 1.9, looking at the way this is going. Yeah, we'll probably be at 1.9, so we won't break 2 mil. I don't know how I got 2.3 million. I'm trying to think when I hit that. That was that must have been a really good round. But, you know what, I'll take it. We're at level 86 now. I believe next week is when that ends, so we will try and get to level 100. We will. We'll get that diamond pack. But there we are. We're still gold 2. And hopefully we can stick in gold too for the, the wet rest of this week. It ends tonight at 10 p.m. when I record this video. Alrighty, and that's going to do it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you guys did, go ahead and leave a like and subscribe. And with that said, I'll see you guys next time.